and I can assure you that uh, we are doing great works in the Copper Belt province. Members of the PF Mobilization Committee on the Copper Belt have resolved their differences following President Edgar Lungu's recent threat to dissolve the committee. President Lungu threatened to dissolve the committee owing to alleged failure by some of its members to work together. Chairperson of the committee, Boma Nusambo, has disclosed members of his committee are now working in harmony. The, the most important thing is uh, uh, to unite the, the, the province. And I can assure you that I'm Lamba. I'm Lamba from uh, Copper Belt province and uh, I know Copper Belt province very well. And uh, our uh, uh, tribe, we believe in uh, uh, uniting uh, the people. So united we stand, divided we fall. That's why I've seen a lot of um, uh, people uh, settling on the Copper Belt provinces because we believe in uh, unity. We believe in uh, one Zambia, one nation as Lambas. So the mobilization uh, committee uh, plus the, the structures, we are united. There is nothing like uh, uh, undermining one another. We are, we, we are united. We are strong. Mr. Sambo says the aim of his committee is to ensure the ruling PF has 22 members of parliament on the Copper Belt after the 2021 general elections. And I can assure you that together we will do wonders on the Copper Belt province. Our aim is to get the 22 uh, members of parliament come 2021. 20, uh, and uh, that uh, uh, goal we are going to, to achieve it because uh, we know what uh, we are doing uh, in the province. President Edgar Longu, who is also PF president, had earlier equally advised against using the committee to set the scores. Lazarus Chichula, Movie TV News, Dusankam.